This single-engine, piston-driven Mooney M20 is now somewhere above Africa en route back to Orlando, Florida. On Saturday, it was here on Guam for about seven hours after having made a 23-hour flight from Hawaii. Its pilots are Carol Foy and Carol Ann Garrett, and they're on a mission to raise awareness and money about ALS disease. It's a terminal disease. If you're diagnosed with it, you are going to die with it. And there is no known cause, no cure, and not enough people working on it. My mother died from it. Carol has a cousin with it. And uh, we're, we're making an event so that people pay attention to us so that we can spread the word about, about ALS. They began in Orlando, Florida last Wednesday, December 3rd, flying west to San Diego and then on to Hawaii before the longest leg of their journey here to Guam. However, despite the length from Hawaii, Garrett called it a relatively uneventful flight. They flew between six and 8,000 feet above sea level and were aided by tailwinds and still had more than an hour's worth of fuel when they got here to Guam. It's the longest flight we have ever done. It was 23 hours. We were pretty tired, uh, but we slept on and off. We alternated every two hours, and I actually felt not too bad when we got here. So far, the pair have raised about $140,000 for the fight against ALS. Their goal is to eventually raise more than a million dollars. But in addition to raising money, they're also hoping to break a world record by flying westward around the world in seven days in a single-engine plane a journey they hope will also inspire young people who are following their quest on computer screens across the nation. Westbound around the world, um, which is a current record that's standing since the mid-80s, and we're hoping to smash it. Probably the third thing that we're looking to do is we're talking to numerous schools across the country as we fly, and we're hoping to just build dreams and aspirations and goals for young people to do whatever they care to do. If you're tempted to think of Amelia Earhart, don't. When asked, Garrett said she doesn't think of Earhart. Earhart didn't make it, and we will, she said confidently.